Hey everyone, it's Rob Furlong from the Marksmanship Ship Academy. I'm here with John Sally, who just finished up taking first place in the King of Two Mile in Canada. John, uh, how'd it go? It went well. Uh, you know, we had, well, other than the first day delay for weather, but I mean, you guys made some changes to the way you did it and got everybody through on the second day and the conditions were amazing. Probably about the best, what best we've ever had out here, I'd say, close to it. Yeah, that, uh... Our first day we actually had to shut down. We had uh, rain and extremely high winds and uh, pushed everybody off till Saturday and Saturday went really well. We put 47 shooters through I think on Saturday and yeah. then finished up around 6 o'clock and then kicked it off at 7 a.m. this morning and had a little bit of fog to get through. Bit, yeah, <laughs> yeah. And then, uh, but yeah, you guys finished up 40... 46,000 change nice. points, yeah. That's awesome. You know, yeah, every and Jordan, year it just gets better, right? Jordan, who's uh, camera shy, was your spotter. Yeah. Uh, so you guys been shooting together for quite a while too. Yeah, yeah, quite a few years, yeah. Yeah, it makes a big difference when uh, the team is experienced and you know, they're used to working together. And yeah. The wind calls is the big thing, as you know. Yeah, well, yeah, it's yeah, it's all the spotter, and unfortunately, he doesn't want to be interviewed. So, <laughs> <laughs> but it is it is a big team effort, and for all you guys out there that are watching, try to make the opportunity to come out. We welcome spectators, manufacturers, distributors to come out, support the King of Two Mile in Canada, and for you guys out there interested in competing, visit us at www.rfma.ca, and uh, yeah. Come out and see us. Thanks yeah. so much, John. Thanks, Rob, Congratulations. For Thank you. It's been a lot of years in the making. <laughs> Thanks I'm to sure you guys. I'm sure it's not your last time. Oh, well, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see.